Hey, what's going on, guys? The Bractac here with um uh, another part of Crash Team Racing, and hopefully this time we are going to. Whoops! Wasn't paying attention to the road. Um, hopefully this time and this part we uh, finish off whatever this area is called. We only have, I think, one more area. I'll just check that. Um, yes, we need to do um, the Relic race on Papu's Pyramid, and then we've got the two things on Coco's Park, and then we're on to Glacier Park. So, is that where we go? No, it's not. There's Dingo's Canyon. We are done with Dingo's Canyon. How do I reverse? Why isn't it reversing? Okay, see, that, that's what I mean when reversing is terrible. You... It's, it's almost impossible to do it. Um, there we go. That's where I was wanting to head. Papu's Pyramid. So we can do the Relic Race. And get yet another Relic. Hopefully. Um, well, I've, I've done pretty good on most of the Relic Races. They haven't given me too much trouble compared to CTR Challenges. So, hopefully it's all good. And... It does help that I've raced on this track quite a bit now, um, because obviously the boss race, I guess you could call it, the boss race, is on this track, so that gives me an extra um, bit of experience, extra few um, laps on the course. Wow, there are a lot of like weird time crates in this uh, level. 134, I've got to beat it in. Wow. Okay. So, let's see. If Oh my god, I fell off the track. Really? That's really bad. Okay. There we go, I got a 3. Jeez, these are all over the place. God. Yeah, I was saying that they hadn't given me much trouble, but this is looking like it's going to give me a load of trouble. Okay, uh, was that even worth getting? Okay, that, that's... Not bad there. Hmm. Uh, I'm probably going to struggle with this track because... Uh, I'm not exactly flying through it at the moment. And some of these uh, time crates are really weird. Like, what's the deal with that? Um, all those crates that are there. And there's crates going down there, so... What, is there like a special passageway or something? Here we go, let's get the... Oh, wow, I wanted to get those ones, and wow, I'm, I'm doing really bad. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, we, there we go. I was just holding my breath a bit then, hoping that I would get those crates, because... Oh, and make, and make the jump as well. There we go. Nice. Oh, couldn't get that, but we'll get a crate here. So I've got 30 seconds to do the last lap. I should be able to do it because, I mean, I've still got a few crates left up my sleeve. Not a whole heap, but there's at least a decent amount. Like those crates there, that is, I'm not even sure why they are there or how I would get them. All those ones down there. Um, I'm basically just straight up racing right now. Oh, you dog. No, no, no. Spit me out, you flog. Duh. Oh my god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh my god. It's made me lose this race. Oh no, 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 you asshole. You f Ugh! That stupid frigging plant that has been taken straight out of Mario. Oh. So here we go again. Okay, I didn't get a good start because of the anger I was just feeling. Let's get that one. Uh, I, I had that race done until that piece of shit um, grabbed me and decided it wanted to eat me. Well, fuck you, plant. Fuck you. You're not eating me ever again. Um, let's get those. Not fall off the track. Let's go up here, and oh my god, I almost screwed that up. But luckily I didn't. 
So there's 48 um, boxes on this track, which is, I'm going to say it's more than usual. I don't think they usually have that many. And I guess it's because of all this wacky shit going on, like jumping off the track or something. I guess maybe it's like a kind of like a tempting thing, like you can jump off the track and freeze the time for about, I don't know, maybe 10 seconds or something. But that will probably only end up equating to not very much. Um, once you factor in uh, having to be reset on the track, so I guess it's kind of a cool element that um, has you having to choose if it's worth it or not. Okay, here we go. Apparently you can just drive straight off the side, so I could go and get... Um, maybe that's the reason why you can get the... Oh no, you asshole! It takes so long to put that back on when you get eaten by a stupid plant. Oh, fuck you plants. Fuck you all. Okay, here's a three second um, time crate. Oh, I could've got that one. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god. Okay, this is not going to end well, I don't think. Not well at all. Okay, I'm not even going to be able to get a two. Oh my god, I've got 14 seconds. Jesus Christ. I could go across there, but it's like impossible. Oh no! Oh, bullshit. Oh my god, if somehow I could do this. I can't, but... Oh, you fucker. Every time that fucking piranha plant thing. Oh, this is straightforward, and always, on the last lap, I get eaten by a piranha plant, or I fall off the track. Well, fuck you, game, with your stupid bullshit cheap tricks. Okay. Let's go, let's try and fucking get around these corners, which I absolutely hate because they're so shit to turn around. Oh god. I don't know why there are crates around there. I don't know why there are crates across there, because you're just going to die. Okay, let's get all these one crates. And let's get that. Now, that's nice. I'm actually racing kind of cleanly. There we go. And we get that one. Only 17 seconds off the clock right now. That's alright, I guess. And let's go around here. Let's get a one. Let's get a three. Could have got another three then. Let's get two, three. Oh, well, it's only still got 17 seconds on, and I was on 17 seconds, like, at the halfway mark of the race. So, I guess I'm doing alright, I suppose. There we go, get that boost. I don't even know if it's going to be possible for me to win this without having to t take some of those crazy boxes. Those boxes really are crazy. And how am I supposed to get... Oh my god, I somehow made that... Oh my god, now I didn't get any of those boxes. Ah! Okay, let's get the one. Oh shit, shit, shit. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, I'm starting to have some good luck with not falling off the track. Now, hopefully, I do not fall off the track this lap. I may have just jinxed myself, but whatever. There we go. I've got the one. I don't think I've been getting that in the past um, races of this. Okay, people who power slide around this whole thing are some kind of magician. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, this is going to be close. This is going to be close. I'm going to have to get all those power uh, time crates that I missed um, last lap around here. Oh my god. Thank god I got that. And thank god I got that. I should be able to do it now if I don't fall off the track. Oh, don't dog me, game. Don't dog me. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Here we go. There we go. We've won. Oh god. That was much harder than it needed to be in the end. Miss out on 12 crates because some of those crates are just weird to get. Relic award awarded. Now we can move on to another track. We're done with Papu's Pyramid forever. I think. 
I don't think you have to go back to it ever again. So there we go. Just, well, in the end, I just got the uh, time. It was much better than all those other times that they had up on that leaderboard. Now we've got to find where Coco Park is because I have no idea how to find my way around this pyramid world. Oh, yes, and the podium. Which is completely unnecessary and wastes time. I can imagine if there's people who try to speed run this game or something, they'll be absolutely pissed that they have to do this um, ceremony every time they win something. There we go, we've got our seventh relic. And he's gonna. No, I thought he was gonna talk to us. Um, okay, now I'm gonna find Coco Park. Um. Which I am not even. I, this map is so confusing to use. Like I, I couldn't figure out anywhere to go um, using this map. So apparently, I'm taking the long way to this. Where? Actually, no. Those are the warp areas. Oh my god! How do I reverse? Jesus Christ! This game is so bad. Well, it's it's not bad. I should say that, but. Some of the controlling is very bad. And maybe it was pretty good at the time. Um, but now that we have, you know, like experienced other things, especially in kart racing, um, yeah, it's, it's not good. So is this, there we go, Coco Park. If the map wasn't so crap and you couldn't tell which way you have to turn, then, um, you know, I might have got there quicker, but here we go. CTR challenge. Whew. Feel, feeling a bit, uh, a bit of the butterflies in the stomach at the moment. CTR challenges have really been my arch nemesis. But this track is so damn linear. If I can't find all the letters, and I, I already saw a letter um, up here. So there we go. C right there. I guess maybe the um the trouble with this track will be is the wideness and not seeing the letters um cuz they're so uh, far out of your vision they're not you know right in front of you there's a T so they have not been well hidden to um start and let's just keep uh looking and hello there you go here is our uh, that is literally the easiest CTR challenge you will ever um, face and I guess that was the um, the problem with them including just a pretty this is pretty much a straight up just racing track so you know doing the CTR challenge was always going to be a tough tough job for them to make it I guess hard to find the letters okay so now we just got to work our way up to first as y you guys know the drill in this now. Don't know why I got that um, fruit crate because I have full um, wampa fruitage, I guess. I don't, I don't know what to call it. Okay, let's make up this ground now. Give me the top three. Okay, here we go. We should be able to take over. There we go. Um, Cortex and broke. Mate, get, get out of the way. Oh, there we go. This should take us into the lead, Coco. This is, this is my time to shine. You, you, you've got all, all your time in the world to race around this track. Oh jeez, that was my potion on the ground. I was like, what is that? And I could have ended up knocking myself out. Okay, let's just maintain this lead now. Let's strategically place this potion. Right there. And we win. I did not realize that was the last lap. Which also happened to be my fastest lap. So there we go, CTR token awarded, and we've still got time to get the relic as well. So we could possibly finish off um, this world in this part. If not, we can finish it off in the next part because I actually started to get my stuff together and actually, you know, record some parts. So, um, oh wait, I need to go in the same area. I think is it triangle? Oh, it's just. So this is the stupid thing with the game: to reverse, you just press back. So I'm just pressing back right now. 
who does that in a in a racing game? It's there's always a button, and it's usually the brake button that you use to uh, reverse. You hold that down. It's ju just weird, weird game design from Naughty Dog. But I'm not going to complain because this is my childhood, basically. Here. And this should also be pretty simple. This relic race. I mean, what do you beat it? 135. I could beat almost beat that um time in like just racing this track normally. So here we go. Let's see if we can do this first shot. Hopefully that um that's the goal for me just to completely annihilate this track. It does suck that you uh, um are basically going so slow because there's not a lot of, you know, um, I guess, there's, well, there's no power-ups. And there's not a lot of big turns to give you a speed boost. But here we go. We finished the first lap in 25 seconds. If we can do every lap like that, then um, that'll be brilliant. Okay, what do we got here? We got a 1 and a 1. Well, I'll settle for the 1 then. Oh, man, I missed the 3. That's not good. But we'll grab this 1 here. Um, our time's starting to get a bit, um, out of hand here, but we'll just keep collecting crates, I've got 19 of 40, there's quite a bit in this, um, level, and I missed that two crate that I was aiming for, so let's, oh wow, I, I somehow got that, okay, that, that ended up being counterproductive though, because I was pretty much just stuck, uh, okay, we've got to beat, I can just race out this final lap over I reckon I mean 35 seconds to do this lap yeah that's not too hard let's go across the grass hopefully get this yes we did get that and I missed that one oh this this might might come down to being a bit of a close race but I have confidence that I can somehow get over the line despite um well, well it's not not a great run Oh, I missed that too. That could be costly. It probably won't be though because I, I'm basically right at the finish line now. So, okay, let's just get this two and a three, and then we're done. So, only missed nine crates. That's less. I think that's less than um the last rally race. But there we go. Done with this world. We actually spent quite a bit of time in this world, I think. So, there we go. We're up to uh, what is that? The the, the I can't remember the name of that place now, but even though I just looked at it like 17 minutes ago, so uh, let's exit to map, and there we go, we've got everything we can possibly get. And I guess this is as good a time as ever to end the part, but before that I wanted to check, um, check the, you know, the stats after Crash finishes dancing here, can you just get the relic, it's just, it should just be a 5 second process, not a 10 minute extravaganza, so there we go, new area is unlocked, well it's been unlocked for a while I think, um, there we go, all the lost ruins done, all of Insanity Beach done, um, and there we go, Glacier Park is what we've got next, We're, where we have to take on Komodo Joe. Um, and then finally is Citadel City, which is where you take on Pinstripe Potteroo. Is there anything after that? No. You just end up race racing, um, uh, the Nitrous Oxide is his name. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, been a really good part, actually. Um, so I'll catch you all next time with more Crash Team Racing.